children in this video we will understand more about ordinal numbers denoting the sequence of things with the help of some interesting examples look here bubbly some colors are given here can you tell at what position is green this is very easy 1 2 3 here green is at position number 3 look bubbly we don't have to count the colors here we have to tell the position of the colors let's observe at the first position is the red color at the second position is the yellow color green is at the third position and at the fourth position is purple color do you mean to say that we have to use terms such as first second third fourth to tell the position of color green yes bubbly bunny ask me more this is fun come on let us see few more examples look bubbly there are some vegetables kept in a row which vegetable is at the fourth position here first of all is cabbage at the second position is tomato at the third position is pumpkin and at the fourth position is here brinjal yes but usually we count objects starting from the left In that case at the first position is capsicum at the second position brinjal at the third position is pumpkin and at the fourth position is tomato Yes now you are right Come now let us look at the third example Look here bubbly There are some fruits given here Can you tell how many fruits are there in total Look, here we have 1 2 3 4 5 and 6. That means there are 6 fruits in total. Well done, Bubbly. Now tell me which fruit is the last in the row? This is very simple. Look, Bunny. We have to count the order of fruits from the left. At the first position is cherry, at the second position banana, at the third position mango, at the fourth position strawberry, at the fifth position guava and finally at the sixth position is the orange. Please, you are absolutely right. Now tell me how many fruits are kept before guava? I have to tell the number of fruits kept before the guava let's start before guava there are 1 2 3 and 4 fruits well done bubbly thank you for teaching me this bunny okay bubbly now i will leave i too will leave children today with the help of some examples We understood the ordinal numbers depicting the order of objects. In the next video, we will learn how to correct the mistakes we tend to make while representing the ordinal numbers.